Bo Gardrippy over here in Plain City, Ohio on the main drag, uh, final Saturday of August and uh, four dealers having a car show up here. We got the street blocked off from four to six or something like that. And the water tower downtown where the clock's at. We're gonna walk up there uh, and I'll just try to time my video as best I can. I, I don't have a watch right now. This is a wild looking, it's got white wall tires on it. Custom Harley. Beautiful paint job on it. I, I, I don't know, I would just guess that it's for sale, it might be sold. Right here, there's a sign. Some beautiful historic houses over here. Even this just white one with the, you can tell there's a lot of love. A lot of sweat and tears in our, these, some of these cars. I'll, I'll try to get them. It's, we're we're going to do them quick, so the screen comment. Chief Chief caught my eye. Over by the old school building. It hasn't been used for quite a while. Here's a Cobra Jet car. I remember this one. So the Cyclone. He's got Torino. The Mercury is the Cyclone one. And the one I saw earlier today, wow. But this, uh. Yeah, you wouldn't think a little car like this would have a cool engine be a, like a muscle car, but. There you go, 74 Mercury Comet. Have to, have to replace the truck, trunk pan in them. Everything. Hmm. It's a GT, and I don't see a tag. The Sportman. I don't know. See, they, they're having a party in their backyard. Go to several parties today. Uh, they're still coming in, they're still leaving too. The vet could be anything, someone, you know, I don't know. You, you have to be a special vet guy to even these Mustangs. And they, it's like the, the, the common upper, I've worked on a few of them. I, I know the shock towers rust out. And, Gasser, a blown Mopar. That's why I gotta look up that street racer guy. He's got uh, twin turbos on his. The street racing channel. They're over in Kirkusville, which is. Uh, 50, 50 or 70 miles. These these were popular at one time in town. I'm gonna stay to this side of the street, and here's where the cars are on both sides. So we're gonna stay to this side, and this is where they have the Dirt Dutchman car show. So you've seen some of these before. This is the four dealer show in downtown, and I'm hoping there, there'll be some different cars. The toaster engine, Beamer. Surprise you what those are worth. Hi. Cook an egg on the sidewalk, a six cylinder 67, which this one should have a six. It's my friend's pickup. Nice example of Willie's, and today we saw Willie's car, and they're from Australia. Mm -hmm. 
some newer stuff. It's a pretty uh, color. They're just kicking ass at Chevy with the. Looking at the bobber. It's a really heavy metallic vet here. XR. XS11, XS. It's a nice twin, XS400. Looks like a Corbin seat on it. Looks fun. The Hemi. Not a Trader Queen. Which I think we saw that one when it was in Primer. There was two of them and you don't see them anymore so I think that's them and they're painted. Seen some really cool Mustangs. Not too sure what I run into up town here and how much the show will be. There's a movie set car. Now this looks like Kentucky here, like um, how they built out on the street in West Virginia. Huh. Some more newer stuff. Uh, there's some hi. Howdy. We're here by the library. It always reminds me of Kentucky when I see it. So they have a library here. It looks pretty nice. Looks like they're pouring the money into it. There's another friend of mine over there. So here we are. We're, going, we're downtown. Try to keep rolling until I get up to the... This has changed a little bit. There's an old bar. That looks like an old dealership there. really like that blue spruce. This would make a nice spot to set. I don't know. The four dealers up here set up. So here we are. They had their 100th anniversary back. I remember when they started selling these in town back in the 90s. A lot of people took a vacation on one of them and didn't come back. With the car anyway. Get away from you. There used to be a big grocery store here. A big brick building. So this was the first Ford dealer in Ohio. It's gonna be 110 years old almost. I don't see the owner there, DJ. And they'll probably sell as many of these as they can get. That's the first two-door one I've seen. This has the Outer Banks edition. Uh, I guess that's 33 rubber. The four-door. I see a bunch of those. Forty. Yeah, that's the first. Uh, I'm digging that. And uh, yeah, it's got the camera and the uh, oh, there's uh, unstoppable. Yeah, this one doesn't have the camera delete. This one has it. Outer Banks edition. That's kind of neat, isn't it? Getting kind of crazy here. Scary what that thing is bring. That thing's a handful going on the highway. I can tell you that I had one. You can have it. These are more rare than you think. And I'm almost to the end here. Wow, that thing's crazy looking. Yeah, the downtown has changed a little. The gun shop's gone. They got a coffee shop in there. But hey, this is neat. Um, the fastest quarter mile production bike of the year. The triple two stroke Kamasaki in green. Collector bike. Single disc in the front. Drum on the back. 74. Uh, yeah. And then they made a purple one, and an orange one, and a yellow one. Yeah, and then you got the expansion chamber on there. You got CBS. You mix your oil. 
your gas in there. Clean as a pen. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bogart Rippy.